I think that it's a good place that has brought together um, very diverse industries, so people from academia and people from um, the United Nations, of course, and government governmental partners, and also private sector. So I hope that this dialogue continues. So in the Office of Innovation, we work with uh, new technologies that can accelerate the results for children. Um, in particular, wha what my team does, it's related to big data. Um, so we use big data, in data from the industry, from private sector, and also from public sector, in order to derive insights for what we do. So one example can be epidemiology, another example can be natural disasters, um, or just estimating poverty by using artificial intelligence or machine learning and data around the world. I think that the best opportunities are um, with the amount of data that we're getting and that we will get. So technology penetration is really increasing. And for example, right now, many people have a mobile phone. So I think that that's a great opportunity for being able to apply new technologies like artificial intelligence and machine learning for good. I think that um, especially with education and AI, there is a lot of opportunities, um, maybe only for the content, like to have systems that can automatically suggest what content you want to read after you are in your learning process, and then having customized trainings and customized education that can really be beneficial. Um, on the other hand, also like for people with disabilities, this kind of technologies can really help for people that cannot hear properly or maybe autism. Um, there is a lot of current companies and startups that are working on um, using these technologies to bridge that disability and that gap.